I will select this cell. After selecting this cell, go to FX function, click on it. A separate window will be appeared here. Here, I will delete this data and I will type trend. Click on go. Here is the option of trend, select this one. After selecting this one, here is the option of OK. Select OK. A separate window will be appeared here. Now I will choose data. For example, first one is the noun Y. I will enter Y axis data here. And this one is the our Y axis data. I will select sales during 2010 to 2015. After that, here is the option of X. Click here. And I will choose years 2010 to 2015. Third option is new X. I will choose 2016 and 17. Firstly, I will click here and I will choose 2016 and 17 because I am interested to forecast the sale of 2016 and 17. After that, here is the option of constant. Click here and left it blank. Now you can see here we have successfully entered or selected all data. After completing this task, here is the option of OK. Click on it. Now you can see here we have successfully forecast the sale of 2016 and 17 using trend function of Microsoft Excel.